the evolutionary model predicts that modern fish, modern jawed fish, modern bony fish have not always existed. Instead, a series of much simpler ancestors slowly evolved into the forms which we have today. The creationist model, however, claims that all modern kinds of fish have always existed since the first week of life on Earth. In other words, when every layer of fossils were laid down, modern fish existed. So when the Ediacaran rocks were formed, every kind of modern fish existed at that point. When the Cambrian rocks were laid down, every modern kind of fish existed at that point, etc. This is very easy to test. Fish are not difficult to find in aquatic environments. And because of their being large and common and having hard bones and scales, they fossilize rather easily. If every modern kind of fish have always existed, it would not be hard to find fossils of them. There is no evidence that the modern kinds of fish have always existed. The Precambrian era is the vast majority of Earth's history, and there is not a single fish known from anywhere in the world during the Precambrian. Although fish appear in the Cambrian about 540 million years ago, they were an inch or two long with no jaws, no fins, no bone, and unlike the overwhelming majority of fish which are alive today. Jawed fish did not appear in the fossil record for tens of millions of years. And even when there were fossil sharks, these were not modern fossil sharks. The shark groups to which all modern sharks belong did not appear for hundreds of millions of years. When bony fish first appeared in the fossil record, they were not the forms which are alive today. In fact, the teleost fish, the bony fish which make up almost every bony fish alive today. They did not appear for hundreds of millions of years after the first bony fish appeared in the fossil record. And so fish did not always exist. Instead, it appears that fish groups developed slowly over time. 